Hello and what's up Madlang people? Welcome back again to VRB Tube and I'm using my Starry Night um, Strat Copy Guitar and then obviously we are trying to discover this uh, Zoom G14 it's the smaller version of the Zoom G1X4 where there's uh, an expression pedal on the side our topic today uh, is uh, making use of the Bank uh, 5 uh, with that said, we are going to make use of how to name the patch because it's all empty on that uh, bank. So we'll rename it. And then we will also be discovering about the stomp option because we've done a, like a review demo of the built-in patches which are the memory uh, function where you select using this foot switch on the banks from 1 to 4 to uh, select the built-in patches the stamp option is like converting this into an individual pedal we'll discuss this more later and then um, we'll combine the stamp option and the building of patches on uh, bank five okay so see you in a bit okay guys so here it is we're gonna be doing uh, bank five because on my previous videos i've done bank one and two from the part one of the built-in patches and then my part two was three and four now we're going to bank five and that is five zero or fifty so it's empty so the plan is it's on bypass and because it says empty we can rename this so click settings and then patch this one empty so this is for the letters so we will rename this as bypass so b then move this will be y Then move so that will remain as P and then cut it. A move again S move again and then we got skip skip so we got S Oop, I was too busy there we go uh, there it is uh, I think it's on auto save. So that's the bypass. Um, the next one that I'm planning is to put reverb. Uh, by the way, before we go any further, we're gonna use this one as stomp. So let's go back to one first. So that's your MS high gain. So if we are using memory that's when you're using this one as the bank now we can use this as like a stomp box so there it is stomp those are your pedals to select the pedals you're pressing this um, up uh, foot switch so for example we are on that stock noise reduction plate and then drive so um hang on uh, let's go first on oh, this one and edit the mic on there we go it's a lot better then let's go back to stomp So that's my drive, it's highlighted and then if I press this one, it will be turned off. So I got either to use this as a boost or a drive. So when I'm doing rhythm. Then doing lead, it will boost the, the sound. So 
so you you sort of get the idea example that's um a delay and you want to turn on and off the delay you can use this option that's ms game led zap so let's see the stomp this one is off you can there it's highlighted turn it on Turn it off. Um, I think the cab sim needs changing. This one, oh. right? Edit. Um, there it is. Mic on. So back again to stomp. So this is the one that will push. It's like a drive again. But there's a tape echo there. So let's say I want to remove the tape echo. And then on the lead bit. Because um, if I'm doing lead, I'd rather have that one on. So that's how you do it. On and off this one. So that's the function of stomp. Um, you can select um, any effects in a, in, in a patch. Because you can have five effects there. And then you can turn on and off the specific effects by pressing this one. Right, going back, I wanted to do this one, um, five. So I put most of the reverbs on five one or 51. So that if I click stomp, depending on what amp or what guitar I'm using, I can just scroll on which effect or reverb i wanted so that's the hd hole this one let's see um just hole this one room this one plate this one's um i can't read it properly a uh, spring reverb so fd spring so let's turn this one off first off off let's start with the room reverb actually we, we can do a shortcut on that one turn it off from here it's just showing it to you if you're standing instead of fiddling with the buttons here and just press it so room reverb <laughs> So this one doesn't have a cab sim, just the reverb. So the plan is this one will be paired with my Zoom G1X on. So if ever, I'm just using that one, the reverb, room reverb, or you put this in a pedal board and you've got this, the all of the effects that you want. And then you just needed the reverb. That's your hole. then you can edit the whole reverb if, if that's the one that you wanted you can tweak it right back again sorry so let's turn this one off turn this one on whole and then let's turn that one off let's go to the next one HD whole Then spring. It's beautiful. Then you got plate. Right, 
So let's go back to this one. I like that, the hole. So you can even use an acoustic guitar if you only needed a reverb sound. And this is the solution because you can choose which reverb you want for your acoustic guitar. But I, I think we'll do a separate video for the acoustic guitar. But for now, this is your reverb. Right, next to it, modulation. So let's say your amp got a reverb. So you don't need reverb at the moment, but you need modulation. So uh, effects like chorus, flanger, um, phaser. So it belongs to modulation. Now go to stomp and you got uh, loads of modulations here. So I just put a HD hole over there and then a cab and then you've got stereo chorus at the moment. So this is our modulation one, two, three, probably. So stereo chorus. So it makes the sound of your electric guitar more interesting if you added a uh, modulation. So. Next to it, you've got vintage flanger. So. So that's your flanger next to it face so it depends on which modulation you like I love the stereo chorus, but you got all those options when you select stomp um, the stomp function. All right, now let's see if I made uh, one more. Now, I think the plan for that one is the drive. So, uh, if you're asking how did I do it, um, you go to edit, I think, right, that's the one, so it's empty, and then bypass, so you can, I think, there, you need to use this one, and then to select, so we are on the reverb, those are reverb, and then delay and then that's like a special effects pitch shift octave plunger phaser modulation stereo chorus tremolo uh, these are the cab cabinet or speaker the 4 by 12 1 by 12 um there is the drive Rectifier, high watt. Uh, I think it's not. A, it's a, the amp sim. Right, that's amp sim. These are the drive distortions. Quick, this one. Muff, acoustic sim, red crunch. Ah, there's the drive. <laughs> drive oh that's uh, EP stomp I need to research on this one okay, there I love this TS drive it's like a tube screamer and then 
so we added that now if we add another drive here let's move this way comp that's also uh, really good effects the compressor at the moment we are just looking at uh, so that's the first one ts drive ep stomp i need to research on what is ep stomp um right that's ep stomp uh, hang on let's turn both the, of that off and this one uh, how i wish there's just a scroll so that it's gonna be easy for us to move rather than ah, this one these two buttons quite instead of pressing down there we go rc boost <laughs> gold drive all right and then next some more let's have, have some more it's quite easy when you press this one so sweet drive <laughs> Turn this off and edit uh, for the five. Yeah, GTEQ. So it's done already. Ottawa. Slow attack rock comp. Ah, so it just say that we've exhausted our um amp. Uh, our drive so let's put an amp sim for this one fd that's it i like it instead of the one and make it as a reverb spring reverb is the one nice okay This one how do I rename it again that here and then patch and then we can rename it as drive drive okay you need to go to the settings right. that's our drive so if i go to stomp um, can you push it with the drive keep it stomp for the gold drive right so our 
drives are oh, we've got tube screamer it's like a clean drive this one One's crunch. it guys for today uh, it will take us one hour of discovering this um, pedal anyway we've got we've done a good job so we get the bypass mode so that's the sound of your guitar directly and we've got reverb we can choose among the reverb when we uh, press the stomp options so all of the reverbs are there and then when we press to another patch modulation we've got chorus uh, flanger and phaser and then if we go to another one drive we've got tube screamer here ep stomp and then gold drive so um i hope this one helps guys so see you again soon and bye for now ciao